Bonjour guys and welcome to the very last video that I will be doing in the French server of Get Out 2 on Ripix's account which he's donated to me to do all these accessory showcases that I've been releasing. Um, the server actually closes in three and a half hours time at 9am the 13th of April French time. The server will go offline and everything will be gone, no more access and really sucks for Ripix who's losing all of his accessories and things. And I don't really have enough time or energy left over to do any more showcases. I think there's so many things that I've missed out on that I would have liked to showcase. The, the sun system here, it's got three recolors of it. The panda maces, um, just, a, just a bunch of things. But I think I've got most of the main ones out that I wanted to do. Like the Samuel Drag, the Absolute Zero. I didn't do the Dual Resonance either. But I've just got on my quick select nine accessories here. And I'm just going to go to the dojo. I'm going to see some, not all of their moves, but some of their moves. And just try them out. I'm not really going to do like a solid accessory showcase of all of their moves. Um, I'm just going to see them for myself, really. Just see the, the general gist of some of the attacks and what sort of like stuff they have. So yeah, this, is, this isn't really an accessory showcase. There's going to be no intro. There's going to be no Laurie's review. Um, I might briefly say my thoughts on something as well, but yeah, kind of sad that the server's finally, finally coming to an end, and it's not the first time. The EU server shut down. I think the BR server might have shut down as well, but who knows when the US server might shut down as well. I mean, there's the JP, the Taiwan, and the US server are the only ones that are still active, but they've got a fairly big player base, so I don't think it'll be, it was an inherit on this, I think. I don't think it'll be a while until our servers are shut down, but we'll see. So the weak combo, slashing the sword, the strong combo. Ooh, I thought this, this accessory had like spiders, but it's got like some sort of like demon thing. The weak hold is a counter, it seems. You're not going to see the count. Ooh. Oh, so if I let go of the weak hold, it's that. Maybe it's a counter though. Whoa, two hits. That's kind of cool. You've got like a mutant dog thing. I don't even know what the name of this accessory is. So the stronghold is like that thing. The strong jump is like throwing... The strong jump hold summons this guy. He runs for so long as well. Look at this. Let's try and save. He really slowly runs for that long to try and get to the enemy. So it's kind of like a trap. Like you can keep fighting, but he's going to... He will get to them eventually. And gives a curse, like a poison, a curse effect. Poison! Wow, that's annoying. Um, so I haven't really seen all the attacks with this accessory, but I'm going to just blitz through it, really. Standing super special. Ooh! Whoa! They circle him. I'm throwing the blade up. Jump special. Lock on. These slow lock on guys, just like that. Run special. There's quite a lot of attacks with this accessory. Lots of different variants and stuff. I mean, if you like mutant dogs, this is the one for you. It's kind of weird. Yeah, this is a gold ball accessory on our server. It's very new, I think, as well. This is probably one of the last accessories that was released on the French server, probably. I don't know what it's called. This one. The electric whip. The, like, thunder whip or something. That. I like the panda maces. It's quite simple. Like, you can imagine this being in the prime market for a lot of win or crescent or something, but yeah. Number four, Icicle Dragon. Loads of attacks with this accessory. Basically just sort of like sla like loads of slashing and like combos and stuff. Um, with ice effects as well. Standing special, iced. Like a, the silhouette of an ice tiger appears behind you. Whoa, what the? That's quite difficult to aim, run special. The silhouette of the tiger again. Standing super special. Boom! Wow. Oops, like that. There we go. Any hold attacks? Like grappling attacks and stuff? Whoa! Strong hold is cool! Look at that! You have to select. Like, if you do every, if you land every single hit, you're able to do the stomp at the end. But if you don't, you do it differently. Weak hold, or just something like a little ice thing in front of you. That's not very good. Oh no! It's like kind of got range. It like... 
it very slowly ranges in their direction. You can see that little ice effect like above him there. It's kind of cool. All right, the Raza Shell. There was a guy in my guild um, a couple of years ago who's now quit getting up to called Raza. You may remember him. Um, and he uses accessory a lot. And I'm pretty sure the hold attack, the weak hold, uses a lot of MP but gives you this state. Now I have super armor. And so, like, my attacks cannot be interrupted. It's kind of like the Prussian Kaiser while you're doing, like, hold attacks and stuff. A lot of my attacks can't be interrupted. I can just, like, freely do whatever I want. Oh, that's so cool. Standing super special, throwing like three massive rock spires, and one for the normal standing special, the jump special, turning into a rock and diving down. The silhouette of a giant armadillo appears as well. I think all of these accessories in this range, like there's the wings as well, um, and stuff. There's other ones too. I don't know where they are. But yeah, I think all of them sort of have like, you, you become the silhouette of an animal when you use a lot of the special attacks. Cool, moving right along. Dual resonance. Slashing with the swords, really long combos. I remember Aquila really wanted this from the Mega Draw for quite a long time and then he finally got it once. Standing special, uppercut. Oh, I thought it would do a little bit more than that. And that was holding it down slightly there. Jump special. Ooh, have to sort of hit him while you're in midair for that to work. Run special. Big combos. Weak hold. I know that one of the holds. Yeah, the strong hold is that. Look at my legs when I'm doing it as well. Like uh, one one of the the right leg, sort of just like doing a little kick. That that stance is really cool. I like that. Like that. Should take a fucking screenshot. Look at that. Pow! Take a screenshot. Yeah, the dual resonance is really cool. And it's really comboable as well. There's so many hits. You're just like, boom, 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 boom. Uppercut, boom. Do, do, and you just like, really easy. Like, you could learn to do stuff with this so efficiently. And then you could hit them while they're on the ground and stuff like that. Kinokun used to use this accessory. And he was fucking good with it as well. Pretty sure he spent a lot of money on those Mega Draws trying to get it though, as well. And the last one is the Taekwondo set. Uh, no wait. Thai? No. Mai Thai boxing set. Not Taekwondo. Thai boxing set, I think. That was the standing special with water. Maybe this is one of these accessories where the, the elements change it. Yeah, so it's rock with hero. It was water with martial artist. It's fire with fighter, probably. No, it's water with fighter as well. So the element changes depending on the style. So with spy style, it's wind. That's kind of cool. That's cool, yeah. So it says there, Vent, Glass, Freppe. So it actually does change element depending on what style you're using it with. So this is kind of in the same realm as the Suma Tinkai, which I did do a full showcase on while I had it in the server. So it kind of like kicks and stuff like that. Pretty cool. I like all the attacks, like the kicks and the like, way he positions himself. In fact, um, original XD knows Thai boxing in real life, I'm pretty sure. Like, this is how he would... He knows how to fight like this, with like that sort of stance. I might, I think he does Thai boxing, if I, if I remember correctly. Standing special. Ooh, the hero style's pretty good with the putting him in a rock. Okay, the jump special's just default. Yeah, all right, is there anything else that I could very quickly go through? There probably is, but Server closes in three hours, and I'm not in, not really in the mood to do like a showcase today. So I'm sort of just going through all sorts of things. I know that the, the, this, the bladed flames, the weak hold gives you a speed buff, and if you just use it over and over again, you can go really fast. I think, or using it again turns it off, so that doesn't actually work like that. So it's good to like have this with a speed style, maybe like spy. And you go so fast, like, whoa. I could go faster with another style, but yeah. Bloody flames. <sighs> All right, well, I reckon I'm done. I'm, I'm, I don't have any steam to do any more showcases. It's a, it's a, it's a ripe opportunity. And I'm so glad that I've been able to do so many showcases that Ripix was just like, yo, French service closing down. I've got all these accessories. You can have my account and you can do an accessory showcase. Au revoir, get out to France. I changed that to that. Yeah. 
So it really sucks that all these people are losing their stuff, but like the server never really had many players anyway. There's one there's one champion rank guy on. But even when the server wasn't announced to be shut, there was like a page, maybe two pages of names. So I, I just assumed that it like the French server, the EU server, weren't making enough money. It was, it was costing more money to keep the server up than just Cyberstep having, having money from it. So they've shut it down and US, Taiwan and Japan is the way to go. Well, that's a good sign. That's, that's, that's a good omen for the future, I, I assume. But yeah. Thank you so much for watching all of these accessory showcases. It's been a really long ride, and I'm, I, it sucks that I've missed out on doing a couple of these that I really wanted to do proper showcases with, but I'm glad I just got to fiddle around with them and show them off in this video. But yeah. Au revoir, get up to France. See you guys on the US server. I hope you'll go over there and play with us a little bit. We're very active. There's always a room going, no matter what time of the day it is. And yeah. That's it, that's all. Please don't forget to check out my playlist of all of my accessory showcases that I've done in the past, and most importantly, all of the French ones. Thank you so much, Ripix, for donating me your account, and I hope to see you in the US server, and I hope we'll still be mates. I hope we'll, we'll, we'll talk outside the game as well, if you decide not to play Get Up to US, that is.